Why do I love TYA? Well, let's get one thing straight first. Young audiences are not the audiences of tomorrow or the future. They're the audiences of today. Young people have an incredibly passionate and detailed and sophisticated understanding of the world as it is right now and the world as they would rather have it be. And for us as artists, there is a need and a demand to tell stories that honor their intelligence, their creativity, their thoughtfulness, and their humanity. Because every person, no matter their age, deserves theater that respects them and meets them where they are and shows them the possibility of a better world. What excites me about T-Way? The money. No, just kidding. I think what excites me is that I get to tell stories that um, aren't traditionally represented on the American stage. I can tell my stories. Um, I can tell stories where my son can see himself, his familia, uh, his community, um, a community that is filled with strong women of color, something else that we don't often see in TYA, which is really cool whenever uh, someone writes that stuff. Um, but I think what's also really exciting for me about TYA is that it can be subversive. Um, just like the uh, popular animated films that we see on the movie screen, um, you can connect with the young and the formerly young, you know, the multi-generational. And that's, that's pretty exciting for me. What excites me about TYA? It's the audience. The TYA audience is the most racially, ethnically, socioeconomically diverse audience you will find in a theater anywhere, anytime. And the power of that performance comes in real time and in real space when a young person in the audience looks up on stage and sees someone who looks like they do, feels as they feel, is afraid of what they are afraid of, and finally defeats an adversary far more powerful than they ever thought they were. That alchemy of identification and empathy has an impact that can last a lifetime. TYA is not just limited to young children and simple stories. It has power for teenagers, for parents, for grandparents who sit in an audience together and have one thing in common. Each of them was once a child. What excites me about TYA is the possibilities. And in my mind, possibilities translates into hope. I hope to see a much larger array of stories that reflect the youth communities of color, communities that have been historically marginalized. I'm excited about being a writer in the field and testing myself and challenging myself in writing stories for all ages, everywhere from those little ones to high school kids and all in between and telling a variety of stories. I'm excited to see and feel a shift in our field from theater makers reflecting and acknowledging that this is what has to be done, that a more diverse TYA landscape is a stronger TYA landscape. And I'm excited to share these stories and create a pipeline for young people of color to enter the field because we so desperately need them and they are gonna be the leaders of tomorrow.